Okay, I just learned a new command on the uh, drafting program. Watched a video for about a four minute video and learned a new command. It's the hatch command. So we're going to play with that for a minute. We'll use the file that I gave away already. Anybody that wants it can get it on my uh, videos. Look at my giveaways and I'll email it to you. Let's see. The Bushmaster. Alright, so what I'm going to do first is change from the black background to the white background. So I'll go to the Tools button, left select, come down to Options, select. Go to the Display, Element Colors. Somebody's texting me. Model Background, select White. Apply. Okay. All right, we turned everything white. This will be fun. Now we go to the hatch button on the left side. I'm going to select fill. I'm going to select the color palette here. Standard colors. I'm going to select uh, this dark color. Okay. Select specify points. Now if your area if your if your air if the area that you're going to fill is closed, this will work. If it doesn't work, then you'll probably need to check your points and make sure that your area is completely closed and all your points are touching. All the lines are touching. Alright. So I select in here. The area to be filled is going to be here. It highlights everything. Hit the enter. Say OK. Oh yeah, look at that. That's nice. Oh ho ho. Looks like you could hold it. Alright, so I'm going to do the same thing up here on this knife. We're going to go to the hatch button. Fill. I like that same color. I'm going to keep it. I'm going to specify the points. I'm going to do this part of the blade. Enter. Yes. Oh yeah. Alright, now I'm going to do that part of the blade. Something different. Fill. I'm going to change colors to something a little bit lighter. See, standard colors. Let's do something that looks polished. Say OK. I'm going to, oh, that's pretty light. Huh? I'm going to select a darker color than that. Maybe this one. Yeah. I'll select the. I'm going to do point selection. Select that area. Enter. Yes. Oh yeah. All right. Now I'm going to do the bolster. I'm going to fill it. Select a color. I'm going to do something that looks bronzy or brownish. Uh, get way down there. Uh, that one. Okay, now I'm going to do select uh, boundary settings, going to specify points there, enter. Oh yeah, I'll do the same thing back there. Fill, okay, select uh, specify points method, select back there. Yeah, okay. Oh, yeah. I'm liking that. Let's see if I can get a black handle. This is fun. Alright. Let's see. Get a darker color. Uh. 
Hmm. Let's try the black. I thought I selected black. Oh. Yeah, that's the color. And specify the points in there. Enter. Oh, I don't know if this is going to work right. Huh. I selected black for sure. Alright, and fill. I'm going to select this dark gray, I guess. And then uh, specify a point in there. Enter. Okay. Oh yeah. That'll be fun. So now if you if you uh, go to my giveaway video and download this or and uh, get me to email you this file, then you can play with this feature as well on draft site. Enjoy. So if you after you do your hatch in uh, draft site, if you say do the save to function, you can save to a PDF or no, it would be an export to PDF, and then you can have your colored uh, drawings in your PDF. That looks pretty cool. Adds another dimension to uh, instead of just lines, it gives some color and shading. Anyway. Have fun with that. Until the next time.